Hello everybody and welcome to another MGR. My name is Robert with RPR and I'll be your host. I do apologize for the laggy content of this video, but the whole purpose of the video is to talk about it, not to really play it. Uh, there's only f three other people in here, so that's not bad. So this is what I know it as War Z. They had to change the name to Infestation because of movie rights with um i don't even know who it is probably warner brothers or time warner or something for um world war z which i think is really stupid because even though it has the same name in it war z and world war z i mean come on now it, <laughs> it's not the same so this is the competition of daisy now they must have did a lot of updating on the graphics and stuff like that because I am playing on low end and I'm getting 3 frames per second. I used to be able to play the game at like 30 to 40 frames per second and now I can't play it at all. So I just wanted to discuss a few things such as you know the whole controversy that War Z copied Daisy and blah blah. I don't really care who copied who. I enjoy this game immensely, or I used to. I can't even play it anymore. But <laughs> excuse me, guys. By the way, I am extremely sick. That's why I haven't been around all last week. I and you guys know I had an operation at the dentist, and yeah, it wasn't fun. So I do apologize I could not be around, but I have excuses, and I have excuses. So what I want to discuss about this game is the good, the bad, and the ugly. The good thing about this game that a lot of people don't agree with me, but the good thing to me is map size. I like the map size. It is compact. It is small. I wonder why that's like. Oh, those are the uh, safe zones. Um, it is small, and the loot table is huge for how small the map is. Now, the map, even though it's not small, but it's not as big as let's say Daisy. It's not, it's not going to take you 2,000 years to walk across the map. Like, you need vehicles and stuff in Daisy. In this, you can go ahead and walk probably from where I am all the way to the bottom here in the Hidden Forest, probably in 20 minutes tops. You know, it doesn't take that long. That's the main feature. So since I last played, it looked like they updated some stuff, as in this portion of the map was not accessible. They added it. Uh, excuse me, guys. I do apologize. Um, they added this portion of the map, Boulder City and beyond. And Boulder City was basically bugged. There was nothing really in it. So they fixed all that, it looked like. Um, but now to the nitty gritty. I cannot say gameplay wise and everything like that just because I can't play the game at four frames per second. I would I would be dead. Even if I fought a zombie, I would just be dead. There's no way I can do it. Um, but saying that, let me go ahead and judge. You know, what just happened. Receive group invite. That is not good. That means someone is probably like right up my alley. No, I can't see anybody. I got a group invite. <laughs> I don't know if they could just do that across the... I don't know. But, uh, excuse me again. I do apologize, guys. It's going to happen a lot. Because I'm on free mic. Um... 
I don't forget what the hell I was saying. Anyways, so days are, excuse me, I'm going to name it as Warzy. That's what I know it as. This whole infestation, survivor, horror, whatever the hell they just named it, S sucks. The name sucks. But, uh, so zombie mechanics, I'm going to go ahead and compare the two. Between DayZ and WarZ, zombie mechanics, bar none, WarZ has it. <laughs> <There's laughs> Dude, DayZ's mechanics and zombies, just it's horrible. Zombies don't skitter out and go left and right and then stop for a second and then twitch out and go left and right again. Like, Dude, those mechanics suck. Um, WarZ's mechanics are way better. Now, as for player base, whoa, there's only two people left. Um, as for player base, I just did a quick join, and I only had three people in here. So that's sort of disappointing, but you can pick your own server. There's a lot of people playing, and uh, you can have huge gun battles. Um... I forgot how to play this. It's been so long. Okay, this is my inventory. Now, the thing that they added recently, I'm not playing my main character because I don't want my main character getting killed. But uh, what they added recently is skills where you can uh, build up experience by killing zombies or other players and you can have skills. Such as, uh, like, your food lasts longer, so you don't, you know, get hungry faster, you know, more damage, more health, you know, stuff like that. Apologize, apologize. But, uh... What the hell was I going to say? I'm sorry, guys, I just... I'm in a whole daze right now. I'm on medication, and I'm just dying here but I wanted to get some videos out to you guys because it's been almost a, it's been a week a whole week without anything I'm gonna try to get some uh, EverQuest up tomorrow but uh yeah I used to enjoy this game I just can't anymore because I can't play it my computer won't allow me to they just upgraded it to a point where even on low end you just can't do anything about it which sucks. But that is what it is. Um, I would definitely check it out. I don't know. I, I don't think it's free. I had to buy it myself. But um, that was a long time ago. I don't know about now. But I would definitely check it out. Great game. Great weaponry. Easy access. Easy interface. I know Armor 3 is now doing uh, Daisy, and it's almost the same except for, you know, uh, they have a better interface now, I guess. But, um, I like me some War Z. I think it's more fun. You can actually build aspects into the world. It's just a whole better game. I don't understand why people hate on it so much, just because of the whole controversy. You know, take the stick out the mud and just look at the games on how they really play rather than, you know, oh, this one did this, copied that, and I don't care who copied who, you know what I mean? It's about gameplay. Every game copied something or other down the line, you know? But, uh... It is a good game. I would definitely check it out. And I will give one thing for DayZ. It's more realistic when it comes to weapons. Such as, uh, you know, bullet drop. How far, like, range and everything. It's way more realistic. It's more uh, military. So I'll give it that. I'll give that a plus. But everything else, I mean, War Z is just... It's off, the, oh, excuse me, infestation 
the stupid name, man. <laughs> it's off the hook. You guys should check it out. And I'm going to get some rest so tomorrow I can be up and ready for some uh, requests. Alright, guys. Well, you guys take care. You know what? Even though I'm running at four frames a second, I'm going to go see what I can do. Excuse me. Sorry. Excuse me. Where am I, anyways? Am I anywhere close to anything? Local mountain campsite. Alright. We're not really close to anything. I can't even see anything. Let me turn that off. Turn it off. Good. Turn the damn flashlight off. I forgot how to turn it off. There we go. Okay, that's better. I still can't see anything though. <laughs> so we have a thug. Whoa, what just happened? Dude. Really? Ah. What happened? I don't know what happened. I'm going to go ahead and call it a video, guys. I, just, I have a black screen now. The stupid Steam thing came up, and all of a sudden, I just have a black screen. I can't see what's going on. All right. I do apologize. This was a short one. It was just mostly a discussion. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Per